Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we go through real cognizant interview experience shared by the recent candidates from the 2026 batch. It all the three clusters, Java, Python and C Sharp. And I will also tell you the materials you should prepare for your interview. These materials or really help students to have get the interim offer. All the best for all of the students who have got interim offer by our PDF. Let's discuss about the Java cluster experience. So this one is the most common technical cluster for Cognizant. Here one students are asked in the technical round. First they will start with a self introduction. They will uh, ask about your project and try to explain the Java related skills if you have. Next coming to the project, they will ask about your tech stack and why you have done this project. What is the purpose of a project? Next the questions will be access modifier. If they are asking any technical term, try to give an example to the questions and explain this questions. Next the difference between equals operators and equals methods. So there will be a comparison questions will be there and try to prepare for this kind of questions so the last question is are you comfortable with any shift and location for this kind of question you should answer yes next coming to the last one they will ask you one most question is do you have any questions for us if they ask this kind of questions try to raise questions like uh, when is our training will be start and what is uh, we are going to do in our training so raise questions regarding this or other than whatever you have you can ask questions to the interviewer most of you have some doubts regarding the interview like uh, only few of an uh, interviewer will uh, raise question based on your resume so most you are asking can we update your resume whatever you have applied in your superset for cognizant only that they will consider and ask you questions so very few interviewer will ask you questions based on resume so don't worry better try to include whatever you know in your self intro so based on your self intro only majorly interviewer may ask and raise questions other than this it is completely based on a cluster whatever cluster have given to you 80 percentage of a questions will be from that other than this only they will consider your resume or whatever you have said in your self intro if you take the interview interview analysis for this java cluster that com questions will be majorly from oops comparison based questions and uh, based questions from uh, project mostly they don't ask questions from html css and uh, javascript so hacha questions will be like uh, can you relocate to any other locations and one more question is uh, do you have questions for us these kind of questions try to make a good convo with them so it will create a positive impression for you next we will see the next cluster the second cluster is a python so you have the mix number of questions so what is difference between uh, list versus tuple comparison question is asked and one theory question what is intention in python like uh, space that defines the code blocks next sql questions uh, comments like uh, ddl dml and dcl commands uh, try to explain all the commands uh, next uh, another one comparison question difference between uh, delete versus drop next theory what is lambda function what is use of self keyword next one programming questions what is dictionary let us see the question that are shared by the students in our telegram channel if you join our telegram channel you can see the recent cognizant interview experience of a student shared in the pinned messages you can uh, see all the recent questions so if you want you can join our telegram channel so this is the feedback of a students who have uh, purchased our pdf and uh, have got their interim offer and uh, thank you for our students who are valuably sharing our pdf feedback so let me tell you what the pdf contains it have all the cluster questions like uh, what is the question that is asked by cognizant from 2025 to 2026 batch there will be a two pdf in one pdf you have all theory and coding question what you have to prepare and in another pdf you have the cognizant interview experience if you purchase this it is uh, really helpful to prepare for your cognizant interview preparations let's see the third cluster c sharp cluster interview questions let's discuss the third cluster c sharp 
In the C sharp, we have the theory SQL and HTML CSS based questions. For Java cluster, they don't ask HTML CSS questions, but coming to the C sharp cluster, you can expert HTML CSS questions in some of the interviewer. First, they will ask the theory questions. Next, second, third, and fourth questions have been asked regarding the SQL. Next, the common question is from HTML CSS, like basic questions they are asking. Next, that is based on .NET, like what is common language runtime and you have to know very basic things regarding c sharp next one coding questions palindrome code logic next other than this i have already told you to join our telegram to grab all the recent interview experience if a student is completing today interview they will share interview to us and we will put that in our telegram channel you can see all the pinned messages we have the recent student experience and uh, most of you have got the interim offer for cognizant and most of you said that a pdf is really helpful the link is in description so if you want this pdf you can grab this pdf so i was planning to make a separate video for sql interview questions preparation if you want sql interview questions you can comment this video next video regarding sql if you find this video helpful, please consider subscribing us. We always share the recent interview experience for all the companies. If you have any other companies in your on campus, comment down like what is the specific video you have want. Thanks for watching. All the best. We'll see you in the next video.